Hey everyone, this is going to be a review on the Vox box that I was lucky enough to be chosen for. I got it a little over a month ago. I wanted to make sure that I really thoroughly reviewed these products because it's nail polish. And nail polish is kind of difficult because you have to literally wear it and wear it and wear it to see how long it lasts and how well it applies and everything else. So it's taken me a while, but I'm finally ready to do the review. Okay, first let me show you the colors. These are the Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicures. And this one is in Red My Lips. And it's just this like hot red color. This purplish black color called Pat on the Black. And in the bottle, this, I don't know if you can tell, it has like a reddish purple tint. It's really pretty. And this one is called Jaded. And it, just like it sounds, it's a jade color. Uh, I love Sally Hansen. It's actually what I'm wearing now. It's a different, it's the extreme dry, it's the dry fast ones. I can't remember what they're called. I'll post it right here. But anyway, so I love Sally Hansen. And they sent me these three, but I've actually already tried one that I've had for years and I love. And it's this one. And it's called Barely Bluebell. And what's crazy about this is to me this looks almost the exact same like there's barely any difference so I'm going to post a picture of I if you're grossed up by feet look away because it's my feet I almost never paint my nails because I'm a nurse and I wash my hands 50,000 times a day but I always paint my toenails so look away if you don't want to see a picture but here's a picture of this color jaded on my feet What I love about all of the Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicures, if I can open it, is the brushes. They are really wide, and they're all like this. Look how wide the brush is. It makes painting your nails super fast, and it makes the coats go on really easily, really evenly, and I really love that about it. However, this color jaded. As gorgeous as it was once I got it on, it took five coats to make it opaque. Five coats. No. I don't have time to do five coats. That is just crazy. And what's even more strange is this uh, early bluebell, which is almost the exact same color. It only takes two coats. So I really don't understand what happened to these guys. Um... But I won't be using this one again. I'll just, you know, go a little bit more blue tinge than the green and save myself three coats. I will say once I got all five coats on, it did last a while. I still have it on my toes now, and I've had it on about two weeks, and it still looks pretty good. So I guess if, if you're patient enough to do five coats, you will get wear out of it. Okay, next is the red, and it's called Red My Lips, which I think is a super cute, clever, clever name. And I really like this color. It's like a very red red. It's like a little bit of a blue red almost. It's coming off a little different on camera. And I did like this color. Um, I didn't wear it long because I was afraid it was going to stain my nails, but it actually didn't. I just wore it for date night one night because it matched my dress. And it took two coats, but really I probably could have used three if I like was going to wear it longer than just that night. But I did like it. It did go on. It's a pretty color. Is it a color for me? Probably not. But I, I did like it, and I wasn't unhappy with it like I was the jaded color. Last but not least is this gorgeous purpley color called Pat on the Black. And as you see, it looks like a reddish purpley color, but when you put it on, it basically just looks black. I do like it. I do wish that it came off just slightly more purple, but I like it. It stayed on a really long time, especially for a dark nail polish. I painted my toes this color, and I knew that like the second it started to chip, I'd have to go ahead and take it off because it would look terrible because it's so dark. But this lasted a good three weeks before it needed to be gone. And I wear flip-flops. This is Florida. I wear flip-flops, 
tennis shoes, flats, heels, I, all of it. And it lasted a really long time and I really, really liked it. And it, for a dark color, it only took, I think, two coats, two like really good coats, and that was it. So, very happy about that. So there you have it. There's my review. Um, thank you so much, Voxbox. I love Sally Hansen. I was so excited to try these. Um, this one, I think I'll be giving to my mom. This is more her. And unfortunately, I, I don't think... I think this one might be going to my mom as well. Uh, maybe she has the time to do five coats. I was very disappointed in this one. Just gorgeous color. Just not, not, quite, not quite right. However, this pad on the black, I really, really love. I can't wait for winter to come around because I'll probably be wearing this all the time. And the one I already had, I have to give a shout out to the one I already had. I don't know if they still make this color, but the Barely Blue Bell. Love it. So I, overall, I, I love Sally Hansen products. I really can't complain. just wish that these were a little bit more opaque. If you're willing to do the extra work and put in the coats, know that this is going to last a very long time. You can put it on, be rough with it like I am, and it's going to last a couple weeks. So it's real, it's worth it. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. I hope you guys are all having a great day. Bye.